Hi, it's Danny. Welcome to this video, welcome to this channel, and if you're returning, welcome back. Deep gratitude to you for joining me today. So what are we doing today? Well, we are in my Wonderland 222 A6 planner to plan for the week of April 4th to April 10th, 2022. So let's get it on and cracking. Um, this is gonna be kind of a busy week for me. I have like a whole bunch of like, uh, personal life stuff not personal life stuff that doesn't work but I have like a bunch of like random tasks that needs to be done throughout the week in addition to my um, teaching and my grad school work and my thesis writing so it's all gonna be like a little a little stew a little pot of like <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about oh just a little stew of stuff just stuff um I'm going to use some stickers from Sterling Inc. This is from the um, April subscription box. I'm not going to go too hard in on the... Um, these are so fucking pretty. Sorry. Whoops. <laughs> Already cursing. But these are so pretty. Um, I'm just going to use some Sterling Inc. from the April subscription box. Um, just to, you know, liven it up a little bit. Very pretty stuff. I love her stuff. Everybody loves her stuff. Because her stuff is so nice. Um, right now, today is Monday. So I am already behind. And so I am going to mark this part already for filming. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um, schedule my week. Uh, and then add stickers to the end and uh, just talk to you guys while I do it. So, how's everyone doing? I am doing well, I can't complain. This is a Villa Beautiful pen. Uh, I can't remember the name of it. I never remember the names of any of the Villa Beautiful pens, except for the Virgo pen, because it's a Virgo pen and I'm a Virgo, yay! Um, and I think that pen is so Virgo. Um, it's earthy and pretty and simple, yet, grounded if that makes sense anyhow so after i film this i'm gonna go for my walk come home shower eat i have a meeting at 1 30 that i have to prepare for um it's with my thesis chair um oh let me write that in at 13.30. I do military time or world time, however you want to categorize it. And then some grading I have to do. No, it's not grading. I have to lesson plan. Of course, it would not be a plan with me if I did not use my whiteout. Um, lesson plan and thesis writing. Yeah, so that's what my day is going to be like. Just like trying to manage all the things that I care about in a small span of time. Um, so let's put coping skills. I'm going to try to get up earlier. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Walk. Shower. Um, I have to clean the house. Um, what else is on Tuesday? I have my bullet journal here on the side, on the slick, to show me what I need to do. Um, I have the thesis right. I have to get my eye exam. Eye exam. I may have to pick up my husband because he's dropping off his car on Tuesday. Um, I have to do the laundry. My schedule is all over the place. I don't like that. is right pick up sh sh is my husband which would be around two o'clock uh 
um, right, and then I have to do play catch up with my EN775 work. I have to catch up. Okay, so that's Tuesday. Uh, Wednesday, I have office hours. Um, I'm going to try not to skip it because I, I figure students are going to need me. I may talk to my sister on Wednesday. So that will be from 8 to 10. Coping skills. Walk. Shower, eat, I spelled eat with a two E's, that's how clever I am. <laughs> you know, one of my teachers in undergrad told me that you don't have to be smart to get a PhD and I couldn't stop, that just blew me away. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> She's like, you just have to be tenacious. I'm like, it's a prestigious experience, but you don't have to be smart to get it? I don't know why I want it so badly though. No, I have not heard from my program yet. And um, I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to be optimistic, but you know, I'm just pessimistic AF. Um, let's see. Uh, I was supposed to film my monthly video, but I already did, so. Let's see. Do, 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 We're supposed to pick out some jewelry from my mother-in-law. Maybe we'll do it on Friday. Probably because my husband is Johnny come lately. I keep telling him, like, hey, pick a day, pick a day. He's like, oh, you don't have to come. And, you know, we could just FaceTime. And I'm like, she's your mom, dude. Don't you know what your mom wants? Like, what are we talking about here? Um... I have class that I can't miss. Even if I have an emotional breakdown, which is what happened last week, I'm not going to get into that, even though I already disclosed what happened, which is emotional breakdown. Um, Who would have thought I was such a cat? Cats don't like being moved. I heard somewhere that you could, you could change the owner for a cat, but don't move them. They'd be more upset with being moved from their home, what they're used to, than dealing with a new human being. I personally do not want to believe that because I think my cats love me. I think every cat that I ever had loved me. Um, but I feel like I'm that way. Like, don't move me. <laughs> I can deal with new people, but don't move me. Um, I'm gonna play catch up for most of this day. So we're gonna walk shower and then we're going to catch up e and 775 work and then friday coping skills walk shower and um, thesis writing. What my husband's gonna do is gonna, he's gonna catch me off, off cuff and be like, hey, let's just go today. And I'm like, he just doesn't believe in schedules. I know. Can you imagine being married to somebody, being a planner person, being married to somebody who doesn't believe in schedules? Like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> He does do the to-do list. He will, like, when we first moved in together, he's like, okay, what do we need to do? He'd get a piece of paper, try to take one of my pens, which I'd be like, stay away from my pens. And he's like, let's do a to-do list. He's a little pen thief. Did I tell you that? My, my husband likes to steal pens. Like, he'll sign a receipt and just take the pen. I'm like, what are you doing? Especially if it has the name of the place that we're at. He has a bunch of random pens from, like, 
across the country. He's a pen thief, <laughs> which is why I'm like, don't touch my pens. That's why I keep my pens hot, hidden away, because it would take my pens. <laughs> He doesn't plan. He steals friends. <laughs> this is the man I'm married to. On Saturday, my mother is my mother-in-law's birthday. And we're also going to the DMV at 08.30 because it's on the way to New York. Um, Sunday is lesson planning, filming, and grading. Yeah. And that is my schedule. That is the bare bones schedule. I'm doing bare bones in here because life's short. Um, <laughs> so let's take some of these beautiful flowers. Um, today's April 4th. I'm not going to go into why today's special, but it is. And, um,. So today gets a big flower. Um, you know, I'm being very secretive today. Like, Danny, why are you being so secretive? Um, you'd be surprised. As much as I talk and tell y'all everything, there are some things that I'd like to keep close to my heart. And uh, today is a special day. I wouldn't be here if today didn't happen the way it happened, if that makes any sense. Um, anyway, enough of that sentimental bull. <laughs> I love these flowers. These are sterling ink flowers. Did I mention that? Sterling ink. I love them. I was trying to decide which one I like more. Do I like the premium matte or do I like the transparent matte? And I think I like the transparent matte. It's winning me over. It is winning me over. Put that on thesis writing. Oh, okay. I was just making sure I put something, my sister down. I don't want to forget my sister. Ever. Um, I'm just haphazardously putting flowers where it just would look like it makes sense, if that makes any sense. <laughs> And I'm just having fun, you know? Stickers are supposed to be fun. There we go. And that is it. That is, let me throw this out. Um, do I wanna add more? Nah. That's my week. Uh, for April 4th to April 10th. Um, thank you so much for watching and listening to me ramble and babble. I appreciate every single one of you, um, whether you just view it and move about your day, or listen and move about your day, comment and move about your day. <laughs> thank you for everything. I really, really, really appreciate you, and this channel has helped me get through a lot. Um, so when I say deep gratitude to you, I really, really mean it. Anyway, remember to question everything except your instincts, and I will be sure to catch you on the flips. Bye.